Hey guys, hey guys, it's your girl Kayla B. You know me and I'm coming at you with another video. Yes, another video. It is the end of the month. Ooh, I have empties for you guys. I have a favorite for you guys. But before all of that, right here, um, I already parked my face. This is the Shop My Stash end of the month edition. Yes, I didn't do a beginning Shop My Stash because the time I was going to upload a video and all the mechanical issues that happened it was not the first of the month it was in the first Sunday of the month and it wasn't the second Sunday of the month it was like the first the, the second no the third like Tuesday of the month anyways I was like you know what I'm not even gonna do that I'm just gonna do the end of the month and show you guys what I actually put in my shop my stash and what I've been using this month so that's what I'm gonna do for you guys um this is just a way for me to like get through the stuff that I have and also incorporate the new stuff that I have but yeah just to get through the stuff I have because I have like a lot of stuff and I really don't need any new stuff that's the reason why I didn't really participate big in the um the Sephora VIP sale and and five and, and every other <laughs> rouge insider sale like i did not this for sale i did not participate in that and then ulta i only bought like one thing or two things from ulta so it's like i really i really don't need stuff <sighs> really just need clothes and food that's what i need i don't need any more makeup and skincare right now like a whole bunch of it i mean maybe some toners i should have bought toners that's what I should have done. Anyways, let's get into this. For my face to prep it, I used the L'Oreal Spackle Skin Prepping Primer, Hydrate, and then the Pixi Skin Treats Glow Mist right here. These two are my favorite during the winter. Well, this is my favorite during the winter. This I just got introduced to by Box Charm a couple months ago, and I like them together. So that's what I've been using for my base for like this month. And now we're gonna go into the eyes. This month I actually got the Violet Voss Sunset Sky Palette. That's what it's called. No, Violet Sunset Palette. And I already used the majority of the shades. Like here's the palette. Besides Lilac, Violet Sunset, and Vanilla. Those are the three shades I have not used. But all oh, these beautiful shades. Like come on now. Like Champagne is beautiful in the eyes. But I'm gonna go violet today. Should probably change my my hat, right? Nah, I'm gonna keep it like that. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it like that. Oh, do you like my chain? My my K chain? Yeah, I got it for myself. It was like, yo, I love stuff that has like initials and stuff. Like, why do I not just buy it for myself? I saw it. It was cute. I was like, yes, yes, I need to have it. Ooh. If you can hear like stuff in the background, it's because I live on the first floor and I yeah, I hear everything from my apartment. And the funny thing is that I yell at people out the window and they cannot hear me, but I can hear them. So weird. Ugh, I mean, but that's great. Nobody can hear me out my apartment, but also just dang. Anyways, back to the palette. So I'm going to go start off with sunset it's like a blushy vibrant like flamingo pink putting that into the crease and up that's the shade i want to start with i forgot how big this palette is like off the rip off the rip. I was like, why did it stop liking Violet Voss shadows? I think it was one palette that they did with BoxyCharm, or was it Ipsy? It was one of those. And I didn't like the formula because BoxyCharm created it, not Violet Voss. Like, they had a part in it because obviously their name is on it, but it's like, it wasn't in their factories. Like, it wasn't formulated in their factories. So it was like off. And I think I held that to Violet Voss. I think that's what it was. Cause Violet Voss shadows is bomb. I don't know why I just stopped using it and just kept on using like Natasha and Nona. And um, I was just, it's literally all I've been using is Huda and Natasha and Nona shadows. Like, 
Who am I? I'm that bougie? Like, come on now, no. I don't even have a dollar to my name. After all this and after rent and everything else, like, B-I-C-C-H, I'm broke. Uh, that's why I really don't go out. Everybody's like, Kayla, why don't you go out? It's that thirst, because I'm broke, bitch. It's like, and the money that I do have, I don't want to use it on liquor when I have liquor at the house. I don't want to use it when I have hookah at the house or on hookah outside just because I'm with you guys and I feel like I have to drink something and smoke something to have fun. And I just don't want to just sit there looking stupid because I really don't want to dance. So it's like, it's no. Like, no. Because it's like, I don't want to dance. I don't, I don't, I don't. I like dancing by myself or with the people that I love, not with the people that I love and strangers. You know, I mean, I, yeah, you could, you know, make strangers your friends and, you know, chop it up and be social, but I'd rather be home watching movies, watching TV, and just chilling the night away. That's how I am. All right, I'm going to take lilac right here. No, wait, I want to take vanilla. I'm going to take vanilla on the brow bone. But yeah, I just want to live my life the way how I want it. And I just want to be on the couch watching shows, eating my ice cream. Like, that's, that's a good day for me. It's just me by myself eating ice cream. That's fun for me. Or me by myself going to the movies. Or me going to an art show. Like, that's fun for me. Because I'm only paying for myself. I don't want to pay for anybody else. Like, unless I have a Groupon. And, and I'm like, oh, hey, you want to come with me? But, like, no. Nah. I rather do shit myself. So I don't got to pay for anyone. That's just how I am. I'm taking lilac. That purple shade. And I'm going to take that on the outer corner. Using the same brush. This is... What are the Anastasia brushes? Oh, did you not see that? Yes. Oh. Okay, with this shade, I do have to pack it on first before blending, but I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, I'm taking Violet Sunset. That's the purple shimmery shade, and I'm taking that all over the lid. It's going to be beautiful. Like, Oh, look at that. Whoa. Yes. All right, I put vanilla in the inner corner. But that's all I'm going to do today. I was going to do a wing. But this is so pretty, I don't want to do a wing. But I am going to show you what I've been using for my wing. It is Koki Professional Long Wear Liquid Eyeliner. I love this stuff. This is what I've been using for this month. Plus, my other eyeshadow that I've been using for this month has been the Mented Everyday Eyeshadow Palette and the Morphe um, Eyeshadow Palette 3B, the Cure Nude. You guys know this is the only Morphe palette that I love from Morphe. Like, I don't know what's wrong, but their minis, their three sets, is a better formula than their regular actual shades. So, that's what I like. For real, for real. And yeah, that's it for the eyeshadow that I've been using. Let's go on to complexion. So for concealer, I'm gonna be using the Dust of Colors Deep 28. So this is Nature Hue Full Coverage Concealer. It gets darker than what it, it looks like in the tube. That's what it was me when I saw the other one. The one that I have, I think it's 30. 30, that's the one they have. That's the one that effed me up. But yeah, what I like to do my eyeshadow first is because you could just clean it up on the way. But I do have to tell you that this palette, even though it's so great, and it also is only going to cost $36, uh, it does have some fallout with the shimmers. You do have the spray to like get stuff down, but you don't get the same effect. So yeah, keep that in mind. Also with the bright color, the purple, I had to pack it on and then blend it instead of just going straight up in it. 
So I'm gonna keep in mind of that. And yeah, that's it. So I'm gonna let it sit for a minute, you know, do this thing, oxidize. And I'm gonna go in with the Morphe Glow Stunner SPF 30 Broad Spectrum um, Hydrating Tinted Moisturizer. I love this stuff. I love to go in like with a heavy concealer and a tinted moisturizer to make it look more natural, even though it's not natural. But for concealer and um, foundation that I also been using is the Tarte Shape Tape Glow Wand and the Foundation Stick by Tristique. These are the stuff that I've actually been using and loving. So I'm happy about that. That just made me happy. <laughs> oh, sugar honey. Iced tea, put it on a size tea. Let's do this, let's, let's do this. So what I do, usually I put it on the brush, but today I kinda wanna just put it on my face. And do it from there. So I'm gonna blend this out and then I'm gonna come back to you. All right, for powder, I'm using my Laura Geller Toffee by Thin Balance Correct, Color Correcting Foundation. This is what I've just been using to set up my face. Just to like even everything out. And to set it. It's not picky or anything, and I love it because it just blurs shit that I need to be blurred. I've always liked this. I went back to oldie. It's not an old set anymore. Did you guys know that Marc Jacobs is not in Sephora anymore? I mean, online, yes, but that's online, not in stores. Like, that could have been useful to me. When I was going in, I was going in for my Marc Jacobs powder when I went to the Sephora and I was like, oh dang, so I got a different powder, but still, that would have been great news to me. Cause then I would have never, you know, went all the way to Sephora. I mean, I did get some other stuff. It's like, do I really need those things? No, right? Yeah, no. Everything is like totally perfect. Okay, for my face, I'm using the Pure Palette in Deep. I use the bronzer part and the blush part. I don't know if I'm gonna use the, it was in Dark Deep. I think I am gonna use the highlight. I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of highlight. Oh, yes. Okay, for mascara, I use the Triple Shot XSL Mascara from Ciate. This is the only mascara that I've been using because I'm trying to get rid of this and my um, Thrive Mascara. Like, I'm really trying to use this up. Those are the oldest one, the ones that I've been, um, that I opened. Because, you know, after, like, I think it's six months, three months. Well, six months, I was right. I think that's bad. This is the Kaja lipstick and babe oh for babe oh yeah besides this i also have for lipstick um a cemented lip gloss for lipstick i have the fenty um what is this called i i know this one from the bottom of my heart this is Feco Fiesta by Fenty. They don't make this anymore. Um, minted lip gloss and then minted um, lip liner and night lip glosses in correlation. That's the one that I've been using. That's my favorite trio. Oh, my favorite trio. I've been using that nonstop for the fall. And for lip gloss over this, I'm going to be using the Violet Voss lip gloss. Oh in uh dream 
I just got like a little, a little something to, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's it. That's the look. What do you guys think? How do you guys think I did? Comment down below. Let me know. And yeah, that's it for the end of the month. That's my shot, my stash. Oh, and my setting spray, my Maven Beauty Rose Water Setting Spray. That's what I've also been using. But yeah, that's it. All right, so if you haven't seen the rest of my videos, video right here, video right here. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe right here. Okay, and all my information will be down below in the description box. Don't forget to check the description box. Always check the description box. Anyways, deuces, deuces. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm going to wipe this off when I'm done with it. Don't worry, I am.